Science. Margarita Hack is almost 90 years old, but remains one of the brightest sparks in Italy's scientific community. She's been a guiding light for many in the world of astrophysics. Numerous books, articles and frequent appearances on TV and radio have also helped seal her status. Hack has made a considerable contribution to the study of the spectral classification of many groups of stars. The asteroid 8558 Hack, discovered in 1995, was named in her honor. She continues to carry out research work as her opinion on various matters is still widely sought, not least by our own intrepid reporter Claudia Rocco, who visited her home in Trieste, northern Italy, to talk about God and what effect, if any, the moon has on our lives. It is impossible to prove scientifically that God exists or that God doesn't exist. The idea of God doesn't convince me. I don't believe. I prefer to believe that there is matter and that matter has the properties we observe. That is, from the primitive soup of elementary particles, it had the ability, the capacity to come together to form increasingly complex bodies until you come to us. Her colleagues appreciate her frankness and openness. In my opinion, the originality of Margarita is that she's always said what she thinks to anyone under any circumstances, both in life and in science. With Margarita Hack, we'll try to understand if some popular beliefs, very widespread in the field of astrophysics, have a scientific basis or not. Let's start with the Moon. The Moon has been for centuries linked to many superstitions and popular beliefs. Do they have any scientific credibility according to Margarita Hack? Professor, some people say that the moon affects sleep. For example, they say, I didn't sleep last night because it was a full moon. Can that be true? Well, if they've left the blinds open, with the full moon, the nights are much brighter. The only influence that the full moon can have is to illuminate the sky too much, and the people who need the absolute dark to sleep, they may sleep badly. Some people also say that the moon has an influence on childbirth. I think this is one of many superstitions. What influence can the moon have? The moon's orbit around the Earth is nearly circular, so there aren't big variations in gravitational attraction by the moon on women about to give birth. Does the moon affect a woman's menstrual cycle? Is there any scientific basis in that belief? I think it's a myth, probably due to the fact that the period of menstruation is on average more or less equal to that of the moon. Perhaps this has given rise to the belief. It's also said that the moon has a great influence on gardening, agriculture, especially grapes for wine. Farmers swear on that. They're absolutely convinced that the moon has an influence on agriculture. I think the moon may have some influence on plant growth. Perhaps when the moon is full, there is more light, and perhaps the plants grow more quickly than when it's dark. It could be. As the moon can have a certain influence on insects or birds, for the reasons I've already mentioned, that the nights are very bright during full moon, but I see no other possible physical influences.